My name's Lee, I'm one of the co-founders of Global Street Art. Our mission is to live in painted cities. To help us achieve our mission, we've created several programs. One of the programs we're most proud of is Art for Estates. We founded Art for Estates last year with the aim of getting more public murals in housing estates in London. We recently completed our pilot project in North London and have organised over 30 murals in the Chalk Farm housing estate. We're very lucky to get a whole lot of different artists coming from all over the world to paint for us free of charge. And the best part is because they come from different parts of the world and they've got different styles, it appeals to different people on their state. At the moment, we've got somebody come all the way from South Africa and it's gonna leave us with an elephant. I like bright and happy. It needs to be something that changes the environment in a, in a happy way. We match our network of good friends and artists from all over the world who are looking for places to paint murals in London with appropriate spaces and housing estates. I'm from Brazil, from you? Sao Paulo, spreading a message of love on the streets. And uh, so I try to all of my paintings on the streets to be with this message, very happy and colourful. We build trust and relationships with local residents' associations and empower them to select appropriate artists. Public art in estates is great for kids, it improves the colour and visibility of the estate, turning drab and or defaced walls into visual assets whilst reducing nuisance tagging. Public art also supports a sense of belonging and pride while stimulating conversation and participation in the arts amongst residents. I think it looks really, really nice. Looks good, guys. Yeah, it's great art, great art. Brightens up the place. Yeah. During the pilot project in Chalk Farm, we figured out a process. Firstly, we come up with a proposal. We meet with estate managers and residents associations to discuss in depth our process, including how we identify sites, how we propose artists, how we ensure quality, and what happens if something might go wrong. Troubleshooting and ongoing maintenance. Working with Global Street Art, providing this for us at no cost to us, um, to me it's a win-win. We are providing the canvas for the artists and, you know, the artists are also showcasing their work. So it's a win-win for both sides. We remain in close contact with the estate over time to address any issues and arrange to periodically repaint murals. I think that's all right. I'd be happy to paint on that. But this is no ordinary graffiti. It's street art. 33 handcrafted murals covering walls and doors that were once tagged and tatty. I've lived in this block of flats more than 30 years and seeing all the different artwork that you see around nowadays I think that's great that we beautify everything and make everything cheerful so that everybody can have a smile on their face. Anti-social behaviour is down and there's been no unauthorised graffiti. 